Saturday, Friday and Saturday. That's right. Hey, Jordan. Chris is going to be uh, hanging out for a couple of days. So I'll be able to do some torture. I mean, not torturing, but um, activities. <laughs> and uh, looking forward to Chris meeting Chuck. Chuck says hello, Chris. All right, we bring him in. Here we go. He's our contestant, sports fans. He loves snakes. We're going to hook him up. At the time when he thinks that no snakes should be there. Oh, there what was that? Nothing. I didn't hear, what? I didn't, I didn't hear all of what you were saying. Oh, I forgot what I said. Uh, <laughs> I, have yeah. to, I have a tendency to forget things. You know, yeah. old and everything, right? I have yeah. a hard time yeah. For, you forget deals that are made and whatnot. Yeah. Yeah, deals. <laughs> deals. <laughs> this is the Kami Manor. This is all about the footage. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this I'll, is all I'll, about the footage. I'll I'll remember that with the footage I got. That's messed up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. First, first purple rain, goodbye. <laughs> yep. Bye bye. <laughs> You're being blackmailed. See, Chris <laughs> is working on a new video intro for me for the Purple Rain movie. And uh, it's like really good. It's probably his best work he's ever done. And if I if I bring any stakes into it, I'll never see Purple Rain. Nope. <laughs> Is that basically about it? Yep. Yep. Hundred yep. <laughs> percent. I guess there's no stakes. I guess there's no, no. stakes. No. Uh, all right. But so we so no stakes. I need Purple Rain. Otherwise, I probably would. But I won't. Uh, you know. Now I need to know from you though. From all these fine folk, uh, first off, was it some some folks may not know who you are because this is the the other channel. So tell oh. people who you are and what you're doing. Um, well, I'm the admin for uh, the MM page, close group. Uh, I've been helping Russ with uh, doing a bunch of movies. You know, doing special effects for his movies and all that. Hey, what happened? What happened to your hair, by the way? It fell off. I got so nervous about these snakes. It's like you're, you look like a mercenary guy now. Oh, I'm ready to go. I'm, it's wartime, buddy. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's wartime. He's ready to go. Yep. This ought to be good. So, so explain, folks, this is your second attempt. So second say, attempt? For, yep. First attempt. attempt. Yeah. Yeah, first, uh, first attempt. Um I would definitely say because second temp was just kind of me showing up and rolling around in your front yard for a little while <laughs> until it got, is. yeah, well, that's, that's yeah. yeah. So you did it. So you did the tour. <laughs> See, that's why I'm not scared. Yeah. You don't need to worry about nothing. You already did it. So, so yeah. So that was yeah. the Christmas show and, um, I quit at the contract signing and I was never coming back. I, I planned nope. on never coming back. I wasn't. And then Russ came up with uh, telling me there was a documentary that then changed the date, and I already had uh, time off. So it was like, hey, you know what? Why not? Why not do it now? All right. I like that. Now, I know the rules are we can't use any reptiles. Mm -hmm. Or we can't use any snakes. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else that you're going to add on to the baby fizzy tour that I need to know now? Oh, I'm, I'm sure I'll have a list for you. <laughs> wait, wait, dude! Tell, tell everybody now what's going on. I'm mean, getting the list now. Oh, I don't, I don't have it now. I don't know. Well, you need to know because you're not going to sign the contract again. You already read the contract. Mm hmm So we're going straight into it. I gotta see how I'm feeling. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so you're making up rules, things I can't do on the fly. The only, the only set one is the one that I had to deal with you from the beginning. Which, which is what? The snakes. No snakes. All right. So here we are in camera for all of our everything else. You are good to go for. Sure. 
Do you not? Do you not remember what you signed? <laughs> last yep. time? Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm not worried about it. All right. So you're good with everything. Mm-hmm. All right. And and and, and are you going to quit, Ami? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> But so we actually got two. We got two days with you, though, right? So your game to go yeah. as much as much as you can do on Friday, and then we'll pick it back up on Saturday. Yep. So I'll probably quit about ten times. Um, probably <laughs> over over those two days. Um, but uh, yeah, no, I'm I'm psyched, man. I, it's going to take a lot to get me to quit. My adrenaline's going. I, I'm excited. <laughs> yep. Yep. You can do the. Yeah. Do the talk. <laughs> so, so, so I want you to realize one thing because because you're looking all tough now. You're looking all like a mercenary. Yeah, I'm guy. ready to go. We're going to ramp. We're going to ramp this show oh, up a little bit. So I already planned. So it. every okay, good. So every time you're in a situation where you normally just be, I was going to have. Here's what I was going to do. I was just going to wear have you wear the beer goggles anytime that you were in a place that you needed to have your eyes protected so you uh-huh. still could see a little bit. But yeah. because you're looking so tough now, mm-hmm. we don't want to do that. So no. we need for now. No. So now we need to really secure you up good and to be on the safe side just to protect you, you're going to wear that really skin-tight, long ski hood, that mask that goes oh, that's all over your face. That's perfect. You're... <laughs> Now, do you I, understand I, what that mask is for? Do you know why yep. I use that mask? Yep, I know why exactly I why. Oh, so why? when you spray people with water. Yeah, uh, yeah. No, no. It's, uh, Bring it. so it's going to be warm out. It's going to be warm out. <laughs> I, I hope you have water in your manner. Hope you paid the water bill, oh buddy. <laughs> yeah, <this is> awesome. <laughs> now, I'm going to live feed so much. Everybody watching, I'm going to live feed a ton of his show. Yeah, good. Good. They're going to so, see more of the manor than they ever have. You know, it's just a front yard, anyways. I just bring yeah. stuff out in the front. So I'll, That's I'll a big bring yard. things out in the front. <laughs> yeah. You'll have to help me carry stuff out in the front, and then we'll set it up. Right. All right. Little uh, little party city stuff, little Walmart stuff. We'll bring it on out. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So. That's why I'm not nervous. Right, so, oh, you shouldn't be. So, is there any color mask you want? You got green, black, white, blue. What do you want? Oh, let's go with blue. Blue. All right. Yep. No. I'm not sure if the blue one's long enough. I need a long one though to really suffocate you. I need to really add to the add to the uh, add to the defeated. effect. Yeah, add to the effect. So, so this is challenging now. I like that you want the mask. So you you actually want the hood. Oh, put it on. Bring it. And you're not going to rip it off when you get out. You're not going to get all panicky on me. Oh, at some point. <laughs> I'm going to have your hands tied though. Well, then I guess I can't rip it off, can I? And you're going to be wearing a straight jacket. Oh. So, so what's going to be really interesting, the first, so the first thing we're going to do, I know it was going to be oblivion and spectrum uh-huh. to a degree. Now, let's be honest with everybody. How far are you willing to go in oblivion and spectrum? And I was willing to obey by your rules, right? So, so how far well, I don't know are, what I can, how far are we going? I don't know what I can say. say with what, what I, I took. Well, you added to it, and there's new stuff, yeah. right? I'm willing to do the new yeah. stuff. Yeah, but you're not willing to go inside Spectrum. You're willing to go no. to the point of where, right? Yeah, to where, where it's at. Right. I'm willing to look down in it and say, hey, there it is. But the reason right. why is because of the snakes. So right. that's why yeah. I won't but go. I don't, know where those, I don't know where those little snakes are at. But they're inside in there somewhere. There. They're somewhere, in there somewhere. I don't, think oh. water, I don't think water moccasins bite people when you're swimming, unless you're on the surface. I don't know how they work, but whatever. But I understand. <laughs> All right. So, but, but you're willing to go as far as it takes to open the hatch and look down the hatch and see that it's there and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. Will, will you put your, will you sit on the, on the, will you, how about this? If we live feed you, will, when you open a hatch up, because I'm willing, I'm willing to live feed this. I don't care. This this ought to be good. If if there's willing, not a snake to... chilling in that water, I'm willing to sit with my feet in the water. That's what I was going to say. Will you sit on the lip of it with your feet in and splash around a little bit? It's just yeah. a hatch. Yeah. How about how about are you willing to jump in for a second and then get right nope. back out? Nope. 
I'm just, I'm just nope. trying to see where I'm trying to see where I, I can go, how far I can go with you on this. Okay. No. Nope. All right. All right. So there's two locks you got to deal with, right? The first lock is a key lock that's going to open a hatch that goes down to the spectrum area, and that's a right. combo. I told you that there's going to be numbers scattered all about the yep. sides as I'm rolling you down. Yep. So I changed. I changed. I changed the way we're doing Oblivion and Spectrum, even though it's not real, guys, so don't worry about it. There is no real Oblivion and Spectrum, so you don't need to worry about it. But if there was such a thing, then you're now going to be hooked up by a harness. In fact, it won't be the harness I'll be using for other things. It'll be a little harness that you're going to have to wrap around and put on your chest. It's like a, I don't know, it's really, it's, what it really is, it's a tool belt. So you're going to wear a tool belt around your chest, Okay. Okay. Because it's not that big of a deal. It's not a dangerous thing. I can't lower you down. That's all I got to do. So, so you'll hook up and you'll lower down, and then you need to spin yourself around because there's going to be all kinds of numbers, and you'll see a pattern. So, how do I see, see this when I'm wearing when I'm wearing your mask? Oh, you won't wear no, no, no. You you won't wear a mask then. Okay. When, when you when you come up through when you come up through oblivion in, inside the tunnel, take everything off. Because there's no water there. I just put yeah. the mask when I'm spraying with water. Yeah, that's fine. There's no water in that one there. That's fine. So It'll be you'll refreshing. Be everything there. Refreshing. It's, you'll be glad. It's going to be I nice will. and warm. You're hooking me up. <laughs> I'm hooking I'm out. Who's your friend? Who's your buddy? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so when you, so you're going to have to dive kind of down, come through the tunnel, take everything off, and then crawl up the little tunnel, and then you're going to see a riddle. you got to find a riddle on the uh, on the walls. I don't know which wall it's going to be on, but it'll be on a piece of paper. Mm -hmm. or it might be right on the hatch. I might make it easy. And there's going to be... Set, there's going don't to be make it easy. Pieces. I'm not trying to make this easy. Don't put it right on the hatch well, for I'm me. Trying to, I'm trying to help you. I'm trying to tell you everything you need so you, so you got it. I don't, I don't want any excuses. <laughs> but I'm not going to tell you. Now... The thing that's funny, everybody, I want, you, I want you to pay attention to this, and I want Chris to tell us that it's still okay. So there's going to be a baker's dozen worth of bricks. It's a real simple riddle. A baker's dozen worth of bricks, and one of those keys is underneath the one you need. That's all. That's all. Simple, simple. Now, every time you grab the wrong, the wrong brick, then I have, to, I have to motivate you, and you told me I was allowed to shoot you. Is that true? Oh, dude, I hope you have the tanks filled. Oh, oh my God. Hey, you're crazy. Bring backup tanks. Oh, my word. <laughs> uh, well, would you rather be shot or, or dog collared? Put them both on. Uh, you're so full of crap. Yes. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh my God! I never heard so much smack in my life. I'm All about right. to show cool. people how it's done. How's it done? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! This is so much fun. All right. So, and so that every time you find don't find the key, I'm gonna pop. I'm pooping. I'm shooting. I'm shooting. Yeah. Aim high. <laughs> <laughs> See, now I'm thinking that one of the reasons he's talking so much smack is he goes, Russ, I got that Purple Rain video. You shoot me again, you're not going to get the Purple Rain video. 100% <laughs> promise you that is not. All right. And you're not going to quit when you get shot? Not when I get shot. It hurts. Oh, I know. I've been shot. Oh, my God. Okay. All right. I don't, know. I don't even know who the hell you are right now. This isn't the curse that I know. <laughs> Oh, it's game time, Just buddy. So what, 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 I saw the game one, and your tears were flying out of your eyes. I saw that one. Yeah. <laughs> I saw you crying and whimpering and fucking, yep. and, and I quit, I quit, I can't do that, and you didn't do it. That's what I saw. Yep, yep, I left him in Tennessee. Woo! Holy smokes. Oh, my God. Okay, all right. So, I'm going to lower you down. Inside where the other hatch is at, you need to find, and then uh, there might be some friends in there with you just to keep you company because I don't. Good. It's gonna be dark. I don't want to be lonely. Dark. No, yo, oh, I promise. Really? So that's good. Then it's good enough. Okay, mm -hmm. so I will then close the hatch on top, and then you're gonna need to 
That's what you gotta do. Gotcha. And and the only light you have will be the light on your face, you know, which lights everything up anyway. So you got that. You always gotta leave that on. And if the battery goes out, you gotta tell me, you know, I'll lower something out of you. Right. But I'm walking away. I, I'll give you a radio, and you gotta let me know because I don't have. I can't see you once the hatch is down and it's done. So that's fine. You gotta figure out what you gotta do. You're on your own in that one. Yeah. That's fine. Now, I will tell you, that there's one way to get out in case things get dicey in there, which sometimes, you know, I'm thinking it might get dicey. Things might. So if it get, it might, right? So if it gets it dicey, might. you're a big Batman fan, right? You're a big oh, Batman you fan. You know I am. So what does Batman do if when Batman, like old school Batman, when you're in like a cylinder <laughs> or a small area, how does Batman get out of there? He climbs. He well, climbs, yeah. How does he climb, though? Well, usually he has a sweet little gun that shoots him up. Right. Well, you don't have any gun. No, you don't have, so you don't have a, a battery or nothing like that. So, and you can't reach the top of it, I guarantee you. So how are you? So how would Batman get out or James Bond or anybody? How would he do that? How would he climb that? I'm in a tunnel. Yeah. Pressing my back on the wall and using my feet and walking up. That's right. That's right. Piece of cake, right? We've seen Easy. it a thousand times. That's what I do on okay. Saturdays. <laughs> so we've all seen that a million times in the movie. So you're going to show us how you do that. That's if you want to get out early. If not, you have to undo the combo and go the other way of the spectrum. At least to get your, you know, Elliot says, what stunt are they discussing? We're discussing Oblivion and Spectrum, which Chris is going to own it. He is going to take this thing, own it. Bought yeah, a we'll page for. Name. Yeah, we'll change the name after this. Okay, All right. We'll just make it. This is the Chris. You're going to Chris Smith. That's what we'll say. We got, we got, we got, you know, we got Oblivion, we got Chris Smith. So we'll have to change that name just for you if you, if yeah. you do well here. Now, all right. Um, now, so I think that's pretty good there. So that's one of the first things we're going to do. But the first thing we're going to do, because I know how much you want to get cooled off, we're going to do a little bit of, uh, Undertow with the mask on. Okay. I'm thinking. I'm <laughs> Good. I'm ready to go. Uh, you're ready. I'm thinking that will be. Uh, yeah, that'll be entertaining. Yeah. Now, you will be completely tied up like a little worm, and mm -hmm. your job is to keep your head above the water inside the little washing machine, and uh, just don't drown on me. Okay. Try not to. And um, that's pretty easy. That's just mainly to cool you off. Yeah, of course. You, yeah, that's, there's nothing much to that. It's just kind or of you do it second when I'm on fire after I'm uh, tearing up your uh, haunted house. <laughs> that's true, right? Because I'm afraid. I'm afraid, <laughs> man. I think <laughs> I may have to. This, you're probably gonna. You're probably gonna just. Uh, I don't know. Put me to shame here. I don't know. I ain't know what's going on anymore. Put the for so. sale sign up now. Uh, I, I, I'm thinking. I might as well cancel the matter from now. This is the, the probably ought to be it. All yep. right. And then of course Manahorn. But Manahorn, in all honesty, you've already seen it. Yeah. Uh, I've showed you that in all its glory. You've watched it. So. Yeah. But I still want to know how it feels to you. So Manahorn is going to be a test. We're going to yeah. try different versions with you on it. And you're going to tell me, and that way, next time someone takes Manahorn, it'll be because Chris said, oh, this way was scarier, that way was scarier, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, so that's just going to be fun. We're going to, it'll be fun. It is fun. Manahorn is something that people would pay money to go on, I think. Oh, 100%. Right? I mean, 100%. 100%. Yeah. That would be like, yeah, I'll pay five bucks to do that. Yeah, I'll do that. But the only folks who are going to do it are the Kingy Manor participants. Yep. It really is fun. Fun but scary at the same time. Terrifying. Oh, I think it's going to be the scariest thing you got. Yeah, yeah. So do I. A absolutely. But but you, but we're gonna we're gonna uh, leave it up to you and tell me what you know what works better on the fear factor side of it all. So gotcha. You'll be doing it unblindfolded. We'll do it once blindfolded just for kicks and grins, and yeah, then for sure. everything else. Just try different versions of it and see what works. Right. Yep. So. Richard said, what's the longest anyone's lasted currently? Say it with me. Zero seconds. Zero. 
zero, Richard, because you have to get the clock to start. Now, the clock will start with this young man right here once he opens the hatch to Spectrum. Is that fair? That's a fair deal. That's fair. I wasn't even going to go for it. I wasn't even going to say that it would even start. No, no, I'll give you a clock. I'll give you a okay. clock. Because why awesome. not? Let's give you a clock. Perfect. Perfect. But but you but you gotta you gotta you gotta open up and let's say let's say you gotta put your legs in. Is that okay. a fair deal? It's a fair deal. Fair deal. It's a fair deal. No, you got something I'm waiting for that, me I, right when I open that up though. No, I know I'm you sure are. I'm sitting around waiting like here he is, there he is, go get him. You know, I'm sure they're not like. Uh, <laughs> right. I mean, I don't know. They might be. I don't know what's in there. Uh, but all right, that's a fair deal. Is there anything you don't want to do? Stunt wise? Yeah. Are you game no. for anything? Mm -hmm. All right. So, of course, I don't want to tire you out throughout the day. So, of course, we're going to have to transport you with the McKinney Manor Rapid Transit System, right? Oh, yeah. I already bought the bus pass for it. Okay, good deal. Because you don't <laughs> want to. Why would, why would you walk right. when I can drive you? Exactly. Right? And now, we're going to do things a bit differently with you because we'll be driving you a lot. Now Great. you need to stay up. You need to be on your back when I'm doing that because the camera again is right in your face. So you, you know, Chuck, mm -hmm. Chuck is rolling. He was rolling all over, and the camera was going everywhere. You got to stay on your back. It's, okay. it's easier uh, easier said than done. Yeah. But we're going to have you uh, go by your feet. So we're gonna we're gonna you're gonna need to hold your feet up and, gotcha. and, and, and just hang on that way. Gotcha. I mean. And then we're going to try single-handed. We're going to do a bunch of stuff. We're just going to yeah. get some interesting footage on you. There we go. All right. We're good there. And, uh, but no complaining. You're not going to whine with the mask on your head. Oh, whine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And then, and then we'll do we'll, what we'll do later in the evening is we'll go to the morgue because everybody's seen the morgue. I don't care about giving that away. And we'll live feed the entire morgue, and we'll, Sweet. Just, uh, we'll just harass you there uh, on the morgue table. Okay? That sounds good. Get y'all painted up, all glittered up. And, oh, I, I uh, have all this stuff left left from last time. Where where you have it with you? Mm -hmm. I oh, brought it all with me. Did you bring any, 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 no, we're not doing a wedgie. Uh, that's what Karen said. No. <laughs> Karen. <laughs> um, any, any, uh, duct tape of yep. any color you want? You got duct, duct tape? Well, I, I got duct tape, but it's just gray. All right. I got multicolored. So whatever you want, you know, we can make it look special for you. There you go. And, uh, but this is going to be a nighttime show, folks. So we get so we get better footage. So I, I don't know what time it gets dark, but whatever. You, get, you know, so we can't go too late in case it gets too loud. But uh, we can go for a few hours. It's just going to be you crying hours. when you see me beating I, your manner. So. Exactly, that's <laughs> what I'm saying. So I can't. I got to be really careful because I'll be like boo -hoo and so I got to keep <laughs> things keep things quiet for me. And then and then we're going to do Alice in Wonderland, right? We're going we're doing that again. Oh, yeah. did no, I didn't so, do nothing. This is all new. That's right. That's right. So we're gonna go to Alice, and, and you really want to. You really want to be bird. You really want to go to the incinerator. That's the thing you want to do more than anything else. Yes. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> why, why would you want to be put inside a hot oven? <laughs> because I work in them. I think I can just kill it. Oh my god. No. Oh, okay. All right. You got to prove. Then you got to work up to that one. Is that a deal? That's kind of mm -hmm. risky. So. Show me that you can do all the namby pamby stuff, and then we'll do uh, a little bit of tougher, right? Yep. We'll do the we'll do that. It's plan. Um, and and people are asking about your onesie. You actually got a onesie. You didn't need to get a onesie. I, I don't know what I got. I got one. I don't oh, know. So it was ordered and delivered it for you, right? Yep. So I have no clue what I'm getting. All right, and, 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 so, and, and we're not going to do the escape room because you already know how to do the escape room. Yeah, I think I know it better than you. <laughs> yeah, you do know it better than me. Every time we do the escape room, I got to ask them, so what's, what's the sequence again? How's it work again? <laughs> what, are the, what are the combinations again? So I don't know how it works. <laughs> you know, so, yeah. Uh, 
and we gotta get a hold of those guys too and find out where that extra piece is at, whatever. But they'll, yeah. they'll, they'll, they'll do it. All right. So and then we're gonna have. Are we getting together with Twilight tomorrow or something? Supposedly. That's okay. what I hear. So I'll All find right. out. So you're, so you're in Kentucky right now, and you're leaving around when noon, one. Yeah, I'm like gonna that. leave. I'm gonna leave at noon. Uh, it'll get me in uh, Summertown around three, three thirty. Okay. And you'll be sleeping in the dog kennel. Yep. You know that. Yeah. The, the Got a room sleeping with, bag with, and pillows. All right. So there's a big giant ten by five dog cage. You know, well, you were there. That's uh, oh yeah, I've doing. been in there. Yeah. So you'll be sleeping in there. That's nice. <laughs> uh, that's cool. All right. Anything else we, we we need to talk about? But but you want a real show, right? Yeah, I'm not coming for a you fake want show. A real- all right, so you want me to be a little bit rough on you? Yeah, you can try. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> okay. All right, I appreciate that. I yeah. appreciate that. Now, are you wearing any, any kind of a bat suit like last time? I don't know, man. Oh, he yeah, is. Yeah. Oh, that's what this is all about. I got it now. The reason why he's so spunky with, like, for example, the paintballs, here's what it, here's what I bet he has. I bet he's wearing a wetsuit tomorrow. No, it's too hot. I'll tell you suit. what. Nope. Nope. No wetsuit, no compression for sure. Are you wearing your all your body armor again you now? Probably. <laughs> That's great. I love that. I love that. Is that maneuverable though? Can you can you maneuver okay with all that stuff up? It all bends, yeah. <laughs> How did that help you last time? That that work out pretty good last time? It was raining. It was really cold last time. <laughs> That's good. That's good. You, you got gloves though. You do need gloves. Got gloves. Right, and then you got you wore any you wore any kind of boots or what are you wearing? <laughs> got steel toe boots. <clears throat> okay. In earplugsies? No, I don't. I don't have earplugs. All right, cool. You probably don't. You don't need them that much tomorrow. So a lot of what you're going to do, just so you know, when I'm taking you around and when you're doing stuff, if there's no water involved, you're going to be wearing the uh, the having the soundtrack going through your head. Cool. So I, I won't have a concussion helmet on it because I won't won't really need to on that. But for the most part, unless there's water, you'll be wearing the headphones, okay? Yeah, try the hypnotism. Go for it. <laughs> nah, man, I can't. That's, I, don't, I, don't, I don't do that, man. There's, there's nothing like that going on. All right, so do you want to do the, the – uh, that's a good question. Do you really want to do the, the hallucination deal? Do you want to do that? Yeah, because I don't right. think you'll be able to get me. All right, we'll see. So that, that'll be on the morgue table where we do that. All right, that'd be kind of entertaining. That takes some time, though. That takes about an hour or so of you just being alone after hey. I initiate what I need to do. That's cool. So you're okay, bro. Let's go All for right. it. All right, All right. that sounds good. Because we, can, In fact, we'll do that. Here's a let you folks know what's going on. We'll do that at the tail end tomorrow night when it's late. And that way I won't have to worry about him screaming and crying because it'll be uh, – It'll be, you know, so we can do that at 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock in the morning. It doesn't matter. And that gives you plenty of time to do what you got to do. Perfect. (laughs) All right. Now, I will tell you that everybody who's uh, done that, they don't see anything crazy. They they see stupid things like like butterflies and unicorns and flying buses and that kind of thing. So there's no rhyme or reason, but no one's ever had a bad effect with it, though. Cool. I'm looking forward so, to it, actually. I, yeah, yeah nice I can't enough. wait to try it. Now, I told I told you how I do it, right? Already. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we're so we're gonna see if it works with you. All right. Mm-hmm. Uh, are, are you okay if I give you a little bit of of something to uh, to add to your experience? Go for it. All right. <clears throat> All right. So, in, in all transparency and all fairness, Chris does know more about the manor than most people. But it won't matter. It doesn't. That's the that's the beauty of the manor. It doesn't matter whether you know how I do things and, and how the manor works. 
It's still scary when you're doing stuff. Oh, I bet you it know, will be. You can watch it all day long. Right? So it doesn't matter. It's like, it's like okay, so I know how it works. Right. So when you're doing it, it's still freaking you out. And, and that's the beauty of the matter. So, so Chris knows more than I'd say anybody else. Chris knows more. He knows, like, what Holly knows. And, you know, so, yeah. So he knows a lot of how it runs. But it does not – this is just to prove you, it does not matter if you know how it works or not. It's still – it's still uh, pretty bizarre when you're actually doing everything. <laughs> and and I have rules. I can't bring out I can't bring out the snakes. So, you know. That's why I'm confident. I, oh, you I, <clears throat> I know. No snakes. But there will I'm telling you now there'll be a lot of water. I like to swim. There you go. Okay, cuz <laughs> since you're not, since you're taking away some some of my stuff, I have to use what I've got. You gotta get and creative. You gotta do what you gotta, gotta get do. Creative. I love it. I love it. So I'm looking forward to it, man. It's gonna be a lot of good footage tomorrow. I'm pumped. And we'll and we'll try to we'll try to feed as much as we can without giving too many things away. All mm-hmm. right. Mm-hmm. All right. You, you got anything following up for me? You got any questions? You got any concerns? You got any, you're good? No concerns, no questions. Just don't be upset when I win. <laughs> I will. I'll try not to be. <laughs> now, now, how much do you weigh now? Did you lose? Did you lose? Are you I, don't, I got to check. I think I'm about 250. All right. Just for safety reasons, I want to know. So, yeah. I mean, you still can do what you have to do, most likely, but I don't want to get too heavy. Right. Stuff. You know what I mean? Just for safety. All right. Cool, man. It's going to good stuff. So get a hold of Twyla or whatever and figure out what you want to do. If she okay. responds, fine. If she doesn't, then we'll just carry on with the show. Cool. Sounds good. Cool deal? Yep. All right. Have All fun, right. man. All right. Well, these sports fans, we got a good contestant for tomorrow. Uh, Friday and Saturday. Friday and Saturday. Sometimes it's just difficult because of the, you know, like, like the morgue is easy because I can set the camera up or whatever. But, but when I'm out doing other activities, it's not so easy to operate both cameras and keep an eye on the contestant. So the morgue, we'll, we'll film all of that. That's easy because, again, I'll just put it on a tripod. <clears throat> okay. And um, there's so much I got to do. I got to get ready for this guy. Sickle pot, sickle pot, sickle pot, sickle pot, sickle pot, sickle pot.